Welcome to Lecture Online and now it's time for an example of how to find the domain in the range of a parabola. So here we have y equals x squared minus 6x plus 1. So first of all let's take a look. The general equation of course of a parabola is y equals ax squared plus bx plus c. So let's look at the coefficient of the first term. The coefficient here is equal to 1 so we could say that a is greater than 0 and therefore we know that the parabola will be opening upward which means we are looking for a minimum value which then determines of course the range of that parabola remember that parabolas there's no restriction on the domain so therefore we can already say that the domain which is all the possible x values is equal to all the x values and this should be like that all the x values such that x is an element of the reals like that oh and i need to close my parenthesis of course so that's the domain all possible x values what about the range well we know that all the x value the y values must be above that minimum point this is the minimum point also known as the vertex of the parabola and of course we know then that the range in this case is going to be all the y values such that the y value is larger than or equal to the y coordinates of the vertex and all we have to do now is find out what that is equal to remember how to find the vertex and again you know we don't know what the equation looks like if it's above or below the x-axis the vertex or so we don't know but we do know that it opens up and that's all we need to know to find the range so to find the range we're going to find the x coordinate of the vertex which is equal to minus b divided by 2a so in this case b is a negative 6 so it would be a negative a negative 6 divided by 2 times a which is 1 that would be 6 divided by 2 or 3 so we know the x coordinate of the vertex is equal to 3 to, to find the y coordinate of the, of the vertex we can say y sub v is equal to y evaluated when x is equal to 3 that means when x is the x coordinate of the vertex and so taking the equation over here and substituting for every x we're going to plug in a 3 this would be 3 squared minus 6 times 3 plus 1 so that would be equal to 9 minus 18 plus 1 9 minus 18 is minus 9 plus 1 is equal to minus 8 so the x coordinate or the y coordinate of the vertex is minus 8 which means so let's write it down y sub v is minus 8 which means that the range for this parabola the range is equal to all the values for y such that y is greater than or equal to minus 8 and that's how we find range and that's how we find the domain for a parabola